Commutativity of addition and multiplication. What do the following number line diagrams say? In both the cases we reach 5. So 3 plus 2 is same as 2 plus 3. Similarly, we will observe that 5 plus 3 is same as 3 plus 5. This is true when any two whole numbers are added, you will not get any pair of whole numbers for which the sum is different when order of addition is changed. You can add two whole numbers in any order. So, we can state that addition is commutative for whole numbers. This property is known as commutativity for addition. Let us now check Commutativity of multiplication. Suppose you have a small party at home. You want to arrange six rows of chairs with eight chairs in each row for the visitors. The number of chairs you will need is 6 into 8. You find that the room is not wide enough to accommodate rows of 8 chairs. You decide to have 8 rows of chairs with 6 chairs in each row. Is there a commutative property of multiplication? So, you will observe by arrangement of chairs that 6 into 8 is equal to 8 into 6. Consider another example. Take two numbers 6 and 3 and multiply in different orders. Similarly, you will observe that 6 into 3 is equal to 3 into 6. You can multiply two whole numbers in any order. We say multiplication is commutative for whole numbers. Thus, addition and multiplication are commutative for whole numbers.